Hey YouTube, this is Lil from Lil 48 Fan. I have received tons of questions and comments regarding my RGB LED lights, how they work. They have been a great addition to our watch parties, um, both aesthetically and informatively. They show all the flag colors, green flag, yellow flag, red flag, all the status. So in this video, I'll be showing y'all a little bit of how I made the project, um, both from a software and hardware standpoint, uh, what parts I used and what features it has. Um, I'll be demoing it manually, have a little bit of code. Yep, thanks for watching. All right, let's get right into the demo for the uh, flag states. Here's the green flag, flashy animation for the race starts and restarts. The yellow lights are really flashy to grab the attention when the caution comes out. If an incident's large enough or there's a weather delay, the lights turn red to signify the red flag, the race stoppage. When the red flag is lifted, the lights fade back to yellow for the ensuing caution period. And finally, when the race resumes, the green lights are displayed back for the green flag. When the leader crosses the white flag, the lights also turn white to signal one lap to go in the race. And promptly when the leader crosses the checkered flag, the lights flash in a checkered pattern to signify the race is complete. Now since moving home, I've had to rebuild the lights, so I decided to add some improvements. As you can see, I now have light strips on the side of the table, and most notably, the front LEDs act as a lap counter. They illuminate as a progress bar to display the percentage of the race complete. This time lapse is from the past Talladega race, and as you can see, the lights progress from left to right during the race throughout the green flag, yellow flag, and red flag conditions all the way up until the checkered flag. Okay, here's a quick rundown of all the parts I used, starting from the power supply. This is a 5 volt, 40 amp power supply, running it all. And then for the brains of it, an ESP8266 Node MCU Wi Fi chip. And there we have a 16 by 2 LCD display, and it's all running on a breadboard, and a bunch of jumper cables, resistors, and of course the LED strip. On the software side, it's a two-part system. This is the Arduino C code the microcontroller is running. It's responsible for the race state logic, the flag change animations, and listening to the current flag and lap conditions of the race. This information is fed to it by a Python server running on this computer. This script scrapes the NASCAR leaderboard site during a race and feeds the chip the necessary data via HTTP over my home network. Here's this process in live action during a race. Now, synchronizing the lights to the broadcast is a huge challenge, but critical to avoid big delays or spoilers. Here the field is coming to the restart, and the leaderboard turns green first. That is detected and fed through the delay array I have programmed, in this case 12 seconds, denoted by this variable in which the system waits before instructing the lights to turn green now. Still a tad early, but with the leaderboard site being quite inconsistent, there's about a 30 second range where it can change on its own. So if anyone knows a better way to get the data more timely through an API or JSON response through the website, please let me know so I can look into it. So yeah, this has been a fun little project I tackled back in January. It took about a month or so to get all the right parts and write up the software. You're seeing snippets of me putting it all together and testing it here. Thankfully I got her done right before speed weeks as I had hoped, and I feel like it turned out pretty well. If y'all have any suggestions or feedback to improve or add features, please let me know down in the comments. I'm definitely open to hearing them. Like this video if you enjoyed, share and subscribe if you haven't done so already, and I will close out with a quick little montage of moments watching races with friends and family with the lights in action. Thanks for watching!